Hey there, I'm Ezra, and today we're gonna be charging some birds and making some money. So first, let's cover some basic info about the Bird Charger program. Bird is an electric scooter sharing community that riders can access through a smartphone app. You find a bird using the map, and then you can unlock it and ride it to your destination. Once the ride is over, the bird will be available for the next rider to use. Birds have a range of over 10 miles, which is pretty far. But what happens when the batteries run low? This is where chargers come in. So there are three main steps to what chargers do. The first thing is we find birds throughout the community that are in need of a charge. And the app will direct me to birds that are nearby that need a charge, and it'll even tell me how much I'll be paid for charging each bird. So the second step is charging the birds. And this is just as simple as it sounds. You just plug it in and charge it, just like you would a phone or a laptop. And the final step is releasing the bird so that they'll be available for riders to use the next day. You release them in the morning and then riders can use them throughout the day. And the cool thing is chargers actually get paid the same day that we release the birds. So let's get started and go find some birds. This is Alfredo. He is my navigator and director of security. Alfredo, you ready to go? Let's do this. Let's go find some birds. So I've just located the bird. The next step is to scan it using the app and then pick it up. So all you have to do is scan the code on top of the bird using the app, and then you can capture the bird and that bird will be associated with your charger account and it won't be available to any other chargers or riders. And you can always check all the different birds that you've captured by just tapping on my birds from the charger menu. Now, if for some reason you can't find the bird at the location on the map, you can always try activating the alarm. It'll beep and sometimes that can lead you to the bird or maybe it's just no longer at that location in which case you can mark it missing to let other chargers know that it's not there. I like to try to find six birds when I go out because I have six power supplies and it really depends on the birds I'm looking for as to how long it'll take me. You know, sometimes I can find six birds in as little as 30 minutes or even less. Sometimes it might take an hour or a little bit more to find six birds for me. Um, but again, it really depends on the birds that I look for. Birds with lower values, like around five to seven dollars, will generally be a lot easier to find. And then the higher value birds, which can be as much as $20 or more, will be a lot harder to find and it'll take more time to find those. So once you've captured all your birds, it's time to take them home and charge them. And charging your birds is super, super easy. Uh, it's really just as easy as charging a cell phone. You just plug it in and let it charge. Uh, most birds take between two and five hours to fully charge. It depends on the initial battery level when you first plug it in. You know your bird is charging if you plug it in and the indicator light on the power supply turns red. That means it's actively charging. And if the light turns green, that means that charging is complete. And of course, you can always monitor your current battery levels on all the birds you've captured by tapping on my birds. Now, once your birds are fully charged in the morning, it'll be time to release them. You can release your birds uh, anytime after 4 a.m., between 4 and 7 a.m. And releasing your birds is super easy. You basically bring your birds to places called nests, which will be throughout your community and nests are on private property and they're out of the way of doors and walkways and ramps and sidewalks and things like that. So you want to place your birds out of the way but where people can still access them and riders can get to them. Once you arrive at the nest, you'll be able to take a look at the nest notes and you can see a picture of the nest with the birds lined up in it so you know exactly where to place your birds. Before you release your birds, you do want to do a quick check at some point and just make sure everything is functioning as it should. The kickstand works, the throttle works properly, the brakes work, and the stickers are on the bird and it's not, you know, broken in half or anything else. You just want to make sure that it's safe for riders to use. Um, also, you want to just make sure the tires seem like they're inflated to the proper specifications and are nice and firm. And once you're ready to release your birds, all you have to do is select the birds 
you are releasing at that nest and then you just take a picture of the birds you're releasing and boom you're done that's it payment will be sent over to you the same day so i hope you enjoyed checking out the bird charger program until next time happy charging